In this video, we'll share the top 25 things to do in Washington. At number one, we have the Chihuly Garden and Glass. This art gallery and museum in Queen Anne is a spectacle of creativity and color. The exhibits showcase the extraordinary glass sculptures of Dale Chihuly. Each room is a new experience, with the space playing light on each piece in a unique way, creating a breathtaking visual feast. At number two, we have the Space Needle. This iconic landmark in Queen Anne offers an unparalleled view of the city from its observation deck. The glass floors add an extra thrill, allowing visitors to see the cityscape beneath their feet. It's a unique experience that leaves a lasting impression. At number three, we have Pike Place Market. This farmer's market is a destination in itself, offering a wide variety of unique gifts and fresh seafood. It's a vibrant and bustling place that captures the spirit of Seattle making it a must-visit for anyone in the city. At number four, we have the Museum of Flight. This specialty museum houses an impressive collection of aircraft from different eras, including World War I and II planes, a spaceship, and the first Air Force One airplane. It's a fascinating journey through the history of flight that will captivate both aviation enthusiasts and casual visitors. At number five, we have Cary Park. Located in Queen Anne, this park offers one of the most beautiful views of the Seattle skyline, including the Space Needle and Mount Rainier. It's a perfect spot for photography or simply to enjoy the panoramic view. At number six, we have Washington State Ferries. This ferry service offers a unique way to explore the region, with routes that take you to various destinations, including Bainbridge Island. The journey itself is a treat, offering beautiful views of the surrounding waters and landscapes. At number seven, we have Mount Rainier. This majestic mountain is a natural wonder, with its towering peak, glaciers, waterfalls, and diverse wildlife. It's a paradise for nature lovers and outdoor enthusiasts, offering numerous trails for hiking and exploration. At number eight, we have the Museum of Pop Culture. Located in Queen Anne, this museum offers a deep dive into the music scene of Seattle, with exhibits dedicated to local artists such as Nirvana, Pearl Jam, and Jimi Hendrix. It's a must visit for music fans. At number 9, we have T-Mobile Park. This stadium in Soto is a great place to catch a baseball game. The atmosphere is always electric, and the stadium itself offers a great view of the field from every seat. At number 10, we have Snoqualmie Falls. This waterfall is a natural wonder, offering stunning views and a serene atmosphere. It's a great spot for a short hike or a picnic, and the nearby Salish Lodge offers a cozy place to stay. At number 11, we have the Sky View Observatory. This architectural marvel offers an unobstructed view of everything from Mount Rainier to the Space Needle. It's a great place to get a bird's eye view of the city and its surrounding landscapes. At number 12, we have Hurricane Ridge. This landmark offers various hiking trails of different levels of difficulty. The vista from the visitor center is breathtaking, making it a great spot for nature lovers and hikers. At number 13, we have the Hiram M. Chittenden Locks. This unique attraction offers wonderful views, occasional seal sightings, and a salmon ladder. It's a fascinating place to learn about the local ecosystem and the engineering marvel that is the lock system. At number 14, we have Deception Pass State Park. This state park offers a variety of outdoor activities, including hiking, camping, picnicking, fishing, and beachcombing. The natural beauty of the area is stunning, making it a great place for outdoor enthusiasts. At number 15, we have Manito Park. This park in Spokane is home to a variety of gardens, including a traditional English garden, rose garden, Japanese garden, and a formal garden. It's a serene escape from the bustling city life, offering a tranquil environment for relaxation and exploration. At number 16, we have the Ho Rain Forest. This forest is a natural wonder, with its lush greenery and diverse wildlife. The Hall of Mosses, Spruce Nature Trail, and a part of Ho River Trail are some of the popular trails in the forest. At number 17, we have Ruby Beach. This beach is a photographer's dream, with its rock formations, driftwood, smooth stones, and tide pools. It's a great place to relax, explore, and capture beautiful photos. At number 18, we have Point Defiance Park. This park offers great views of the water, an amazing trail system, a solid zoo, and a beautiful rose garden. It's a great place to spend a day exploring and enjoying the outdoors. At number 19, we have Riverfront Park. This park is a beautiful place to take a stroll among nature along the river. It's beautifully maintained and offers a peaceful environment for relaxation and recreation. At number 20, 
we have the Cape Flattery Trail. This hiking trail offers a unique experience with its tree roots and natural beauty. It's not too difficult, making it a great option for casual hikers. At number 21, we have Whatcom Falls Park. This park offers beautiful hiking trails and a stunning waterfall. The stone bridge that you walk across by the falls is quite the sight, adding to the overall beauty of the park. At number 22, we have Rialto Beach. This beach offers a beautiful place for sunset photos. The hole-in-the-wall hiking trail guides you to this beautiful spot, making it a great place for a leisurely walk and photography. At number 23, we have Lime Kiln Point State Park. This state park offers a beautiful hiking trail that leads to a historic lime kiln. The history of the area is fascinating, adding an extra layer of interest to the natural beauty of the park. At number 24, we have Washington Park Arboretum. This arboretum offers a variety of plants and wildlife, making it a great place for nature lovers. It's a peaceful place to take a walk and enjoy the beauty of nature. At number 25, we have Mount St. Helens. This active stratovolcano is a natural wonder, offering a unique experience for visitors. The Visitor Center at Johnston Ridge Observatory offers a great view of the site, making it a must-visit for anyone in the area. So that sums up my top 25 things to do in Washington. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video, and if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.